Hello everyone. Zen says apologies for not posting the video last week. Thank you for pouring so much of love and affection throughout the week. Without wasting any more time, let's straight away jump into today's video which covers the Swiss work permit system. Switzerland has a dual system when it comes to granting work permits with rules depending on whether you are an European Union, EU citizen or non-EU citizen. Let's start with EU citizens first. Since the 2002 Freedom of Movement Agreement, Citizens of the EU and the EFTA have been allowed to live, work and study within Switzerland without restrictions. You can come here for three months without a visa to look for a job. After three months, you can apply for a special permit to allow you to extend your stay while you look for employment. You must be registered at the employment office and stand a real chance of getting a job for this to be awarded. There are some restrictions on citizens from new EU members Croatia. This Swiss permit type does not entitle you to access to social insurance or benefits. The various residence permits for nationals of EU and EFTA member states. L permit short term residence. B permit resident foreign nationals. C permit settled foreign nationals. CI permit resident foreign nationals with ga gained employment G permit cross border commuters let's deep dive and understand the various permits L permit short term residence EU EFTA nationals are entitled to this permit provided they are in possession of an employment contract valid from 3 up to 12 months employment contracts of less than three months duration within a calendar year are not subject to a permit but are regulated via notification procedure. The only exceptions are the Croatian nationals. The period of validity of the permit is identical to the term of the employment contract. It can be extended for a total period of less than 12 months. L permits without gainful employment are granted to job seekers from all EU EFTA states. However, this practice does not create an entitlement to social insurance. B permit resident foreign nationals. The residence permit for EU EFTA nationals is valid for five years. It is issued if the foreign national is in possession of an employment contract of at least 12 months duration or of unlimited duration. The only exceptions are for Croatian nationals. C permit settled foreign nationals. Settled foreign nationals are foreign nationals who have been granted a settlement permit after 5 or 10 years residence in Switzerland. The right to settle in Switzerland is not subject to any time restrictions or conditions. The St State Secretariat for Migration SEM determines the earliest date from which the competent national authorities may grant settlement permits. 
CI permit resident foreign nationals with gainful employment the residence permit with gainful employment is intended for members of foreign representations and family members of intergovernmental organization spouse and children up to 25 years old the validity of the permit is limited to the duration of the main holders function g permit cross border commuters eu efta cross border commuters are nationals of eu efta member states who reside in an eu efta member state and work in switzerland either in an employed or self employed capacity cross border commuters must return to their main place of residence abroad at least once a week all eu foreigners in switzerland have credit card style photo ids by 31st december 2020 let's talk about non eu citizens now biometric residence permits for foreign nationals recipients of biometric residence permits for foreigners third state nationals third state nationals who are family members of swiss citizens third state nationals who are the family members of eu efta citizens biometric residence permits shall be issued to holders of the following categories of residence permit short term residence permit l permit residence permit b permit settlement permits c permit let's understand swiss permit types now swiss l permit a short term permit this is a permit awarded for 3 to 12 months allowing you to work or look for work swiss b permit a long term residence permit if you are from the eu this permit is valid for 5 years you must have a job contract secured for at least 1 year if you are from outside of the eu the swiss b permit is valid for 1 year and can be renewed as long as your job contract stays the same these permits are subject to restrict quotas highly qualified scientists engineers and managers are very much in demand and are likely to be granted swiss b permits easily applications for visas and residence permits must be made by your employer before you travel The decision can take in anything between 3 weeks to several months depending on your circumstances. When you arrive in the country, you must register with the canton within 14 days and then you will receive your residence card. Swiss residence permit C. A Swiss settlement permit is a permanent residence permit which entitles you to live in switzerland forever eu nationals can apply after living in switzerland for 5 continuous years non eu nationals must wait until they have lived in switzerland for 10 years and must prove their financial validity on february 9 2014 the swiss population voted to accept a popular initiative aimed at stopping mass immigration which has launched by the swiss people's party svp the relevant article 121a in the swiss constitution aims at the introduction of an admission system based on 
quantitative limits and quotas combined with a preference for local worker let's understand non eu work permit quotas people coming from a non eu efta or third country are subject to considerably tighter restrictions swiss immigration has strict quotas of how many work permits if awards to third country nationals currently this standard at 8500 swiss b permits there are slightly different requirements depending on the country of origin but in general you will need to have a secure job offer first your employer must prove that they have made intensive effort to find a swiss or eu national to fill the position they also must prove that they other applicants were not suitable highly skilled or qualified professionals are more likely to get a swiss b permit as they are in shortage knowledge of one of the national languages german french or italian can help you in this case what has changed in the year 2021 a separate quota will be introduced for uk nationals as the swiss uk agreement on the free movement of person is set to come to an end december 31st the separate uk quotas are currently set for only one year and take into account the special relationship between the uk and switzerland for the time being permits for uk nationals are subject to the purview of cantonal competent authority and do not fall under the federal approval procedure if no bilateral agreement between the uk and switzerland on the immigration regime is concluded within the next 12 months the uk quota might be integrated in the general non eu efta quota in 2022 on your screen you can see the various swiss work permits quotas for the year 2021 hope you enjoy this video and it's not a information overload as if you plan to explore switzerland for your work these are the information that should help you to consider and make your decision concrete for the next video Till then be safe be happy zen zen loads of love to all of you bye bye